separates you and I think is the essence of your brand that we could aspire to be, not only as a country, but as a person? Well, I don't mean to put myself forward as an excellent specimen, but, but, <laughs> but I do agree that, that you know, there, there's a need for us to recognize that a big part of leadership is just calling forth what's best in us. And right now we've got leadership that draws out the worst in us, draws out the absolute worst in uh, supporters and opponents sometimes. And we need something different. Uh, we, we need a different way. And oh, this is traditionally more of a conservative thing to say, but, uh, but that moral leadership really matters. Character really matters. And uh, I think we need to hold uh, our president to a very high standard uh, and want to, to put forward a case uh, that each of us competing for that job uh, ought to be looked at in those terms. Along the lines, and, and obviously you were watching Trump long before you ran for office, tell me what kind of human being you think he is, because I, to me, think your humanity is, is your best, is your essence, the excellence of it. Donald Trump as a person, not as a candidate, not as a president, what do you see there? Tell me what you see in that human being. Well, I've never met him and I've, I've never spoken with him, so all I have to go off of is, is the way that he conducts himself and, and the way that, that he approaches this office. Uh, but it, I guess what I see is a lot of self-orientation. I just want to stay on that.